What's going on guys? Today we have a very big new review. We have the first NBA product featuring Wemby Yama in his NBA jersey. This is 23-24 NBA hoops. We have an early first look at two boxes. If you guys like these reviews, especially two box reviews and early reviews, you want to see more, drop a like, subscribe, helps us do so much more on the channel, content, and the giveaways, national treasures. We have a several thousand dollar box. We have a thousand dollar plus RPA and tons more be given away absolutely free. It'll be this Saturday. Information down below. Just like, subscribe, follow me on whatnot where we go live for our breaks, auctions, and giveaways like this. And join our live stream when it's time. And then use that link down below to sign up and you get some credit anywhere from 10 to $200 in credit to use on the app in our breaks, maybe, or auctions. And that's it. A lot of big giveys. They're finally back and best of luck. So here we go. Hoops. Better late than never. We finally have it. And I don't think there's any NBA set on the horizon for a little bit. So here is the information. I'll try to fly through it, but there's definitely some changes in this year's new hoops. So here we go and let's get started. So here's the box and SRP for this one is 120 resale. I'd say kind of low to mid $200 range and then eight cards in every single pack, 24 packs for box, 20 box cases, so big cases. And then you get one autograph, 24 inserts or parallels in every single box. So there we go. There's a side, first rookie cards of the 23 draft class, ultra rare. And here is the back. So let's take a look at this year's hoops as fast as possible. So we have the first Wemby, Scoot and Miller as well as the Thompson twins in their NBA jerseys. And then here are the parallels for this year. So some, but not all are red backs. There is silver artist proof of 25, gold to 10 and black one of ones. Inserts, we have some new inserts this year. And a cool one, might I add. So there's presentations, kind of like a comic theme manga type one. A lot of those nowadays, those in Galaxy, they're everywhere, but they are new. I don't think they're crazy rare, but they are new in here and not the most common. And then there's Sheesh, there is Ignition, there is Extreme Team, Attack the Rack, and tons more. There's the playoff and final sets, which cover the whole postseason. There's some really nice ones. The rarer ones actually go for a pretty strong amount usually. So look for those. And I think to date from all the hoops boxes, we pulled like maybe one or two of those at best. So they're definitely rare cards and nice chases in here. So also look for the rookie special insert. That's a rarer one. There's hollows as well for all these. And the rookie special, it's like a magazine cover. We had it for a few years now and it covers the top rookies. So look for those. Then autographs. Hot signatures, there's Hoops Inc, Rookie Inc, and then there's Red to 25 for the parallels. Hoops Art is on card, I believe, featuring the top rookies, vertical and horizontal. Some are dual signed with Steph Curry again, he's back. And then there's also uh, the single one, which is the rookies like Thompson Twins, Kulabali, uh, Kaysen Wallace, and then Keontae George, I believe, are the featured guys. So them singular or them plus Curry. And then uh, that's pretty much it. Wemby, Miller, and Scoot are exclusive with fanatics so they're in the bowman U stuff and that's kind of it uh so no autographs in these products let's get started i'll put this on our free nt box and here we go let's crack the packs and let's see what we got the new hoops i like hoops a lot of packs a lot of base a lot of you know other inserts but it's fun the first cards of the nba season and here we go after i get this wrapping off we did it Better late than never, once again. All right. Let's see. Ooh, ooh, ah. I believe this is the only one we have until maybe Origins. So, not looking good, but here we go. We have a lot of packs. So let's start flying through these. So, Panini has the Thompson Twins. Their first cards were an OTE Chrome with tops, but now they're with Panini here. So... Let's find some Wemby. Like football. A lot of the uh, guys are split between companies. Go Grizz. Got Gigi. There's the design. What do you guys think? Like it? Don't like it? Kind of reminds me of 2122, if I have that right. Pretty much all the hoops designs. They're pretty similar, but I like. And let's continue. If you guys like these videos, you want to see more? As always, like, subscribe. Helps us do. So much more. Another top rook. Get a lot of rookies. And there's something here. And also love group breaks for this product. Plus National Treasures. NT right there is a giveaway. Oh. Harden. And that'll be on my... Ooh, to nine ninety nine. Cool. These are a little different this year with the little glitter or... Yeah, glitter pattern. Nice. James Harden. The Sixers beat the Celtics. So the whole entire playoffs is in that set and 
the better the moment and the card, the lower the print and higher the value. But we'll have mixers with the new hoops, Chasing Wemby, and new national treasures. So on my whatnot page, random team should be considering NTs in there. One of the cheaper ones we'll do for mixers. Brandon Miller, while having a nice high ceiling. There we are. So he is with, I believe, yeah, it's Hops and uh, their Bowman sets. I think he has autographs in just a few sets. So it would be Bowman U, Chrome, Inception, and maybe Best. I think are the only three out. There's more rookie action. We'll get a lot of the rooks, so keep flying through there. And if you're not interested in our breaks, you can still join. Same steps for our National Treasures giveaway. That box is thousands, and that RPA is also thousands. And they're all free to you guys, many winners. Sign up with the link down below, and I'll get you some credit. Actually, someone just got $200 in credit. Obviously, that's not the most common one, but someone just got it recently, and you can too. And use that for our breaks or auctions or something like that. So if you get 200, it's almost like a free break spot. Here's a backwards card. Could be an autograph, could be a troll. Not holding my breath, but let's see. Anti-gravity, Levine. On the trade block. Interesting. Okay. Um, all right. So one thing is with the rookies kind of all over the place. They have to make up with it with vets. So they kind of added, I think, some vets to make up for it. To hopefully boost that checklist, I think. I heard some people say the auto checklist is a little better. This isn't a bad one. It's not a great one. It's solid. Our one autograph. Used to be two. Can't forget that. Used to be two. And they changed it on us. Not cool. Not cool at all. Let's keep going. We need Wemby. And now the big question. Should we do a Wemby chase? We've done some crazy chase recently. Like, uh, well, actually, not that one. I think initially I wanted to put something back there. And I forgot. But I was going to put the uh, something from the chase we did, which was Absolute and the Brownie one. And I forgot. I did the Caden said, which you can't go wrong with. Giannis to, to nothing. Okay. These used to be numbered. Hmm. The Harden was. Am I missing it? Error card? I don't know. These should be numbered. Unless they change it this year, which really stinks. But there we go. Giannis. There we go. Hmm. Interesting. All right, let's continue. But we did chase videos recently. The Brawny one, which was epic. And the Kaboom chase. And following in those footsteps, do we try a Wemby chase? So we've done some impossible ones recently. And had some success. So do we try Wemby? It'd be with hoops. It could be a grind, but I have to try. This is hoop tribute this year, I believe. There you go. All right, a little different. Sasser, he's been playing well. And uh, Johnson, we got next, okay. There we are. I imagine it'd be at least like an hour and a half, once we get lucky, but We'd open packs till we pull a notable Wemby card. Because he has no autographs, it has to be numbered. There's Thompson. I meant Thompson. Or a rare insert. So no auto is going to hurt. Not fun. But yeah, he does have those Bowman ones. And that's it. So it'll be the parallel chase for us this year. And case hits. I'm very interested in seeing who else goes where because the next crop of rookies they're coming and then thompson anti-gravity i don't think they were in the rookie sets in the past or that was a rookie set I'm trying to say anti-gravity yeah they weren't in those sets if i'm correct and i guess they added them now unless i'm wrong then they've always been there my bad let's keep going so top guys in next year's class obviously football Caleb, Drake, right now, we don't know. And then basketball would be Bazellus, Holland, uh, Collier, Sar, guys like that, who already have autographs and tops products. But I don't know if anyone's exclusive, so we'll see. But it definitely hurts while they don't have the license. 
and Panini has pretty much nothing. They have the Thompson Twins, and that's kind of it. And the licenses, but it's just parallel galore chase. So I'll try to speed up a little bit. Seeing if we can find some new inserts. Because I've been told they're not impossible to find. Yet. I have not seen one yet. Okay. To 25, Aaron Wiggins. Okay. 300 card set. Aaron Wiggins, 25. We have uh, Hunter Tyson. For a second, I thought that was Cooper Flag. And that is a big chase coming up down the line. So a lot of promising young talents on their way to the NBA. Next one up. Let's take a look. Wemby. Where is Wemby? And Kulabali. Come on. One of one. One of one. One of one. Okay. Silver to 199. That's a good rookie to get. I cannot complain about that. There he is. He is one of the signers because the top three guys are missing. I guess the six, seven, and eight guys got moved up and are now top five kind of rooks to find in terms of autos. Sasser. I believe he's been playing well, watching some Cade, and I remember seeing him just lighting it up a few games, so good for him. I'll take that. Base cards, and Ja, the Grizzlies. It's a tough year for us. Injuries, and uh, no Ja, and sheesh! Oh, yeah, it's time. Football got it, and they uh, forgot about us. Until now, sheesh, Kevin Durant. I don't know if these have parallels, but if they do, I'm collecting. All right. I always say that's a joke. I think it's so funny. Just the word sheesh, but we say it all the time. And I have a uh, aluminum sheesh for football. And finally, they answered our prayers. And we have the basketball sheesh. So let there be luck. That's a good sign. We got Mr. Big D and got Anthony Black now playing. All right. I like this class. Love Wemby. Always fun to see a big rook. And the last classes, we've been blessed with tons of talent. Purple. Okay. There's Mr. Paolo speaking of tons of talent. Lamello's going crazy. Ant's going crazy. Man, Wade Wunningham. And the reason why I switched that last minute is because yesterday we finally posted the uh, last ooh, Wade Wunningham video. Opened 40k in boxing with him and pulled his own auto. So much fun. And um, finally got that video out, but that was crazy. And that's why I put that there. If you haven't seen that one, definitely check it out. And if you're not interested, at least check out the end. It's super cool. More like that, but even cooler. So let's see if we can pull some nice cades here. Some... One B, so far, no. Went from opening 40K in high-end boxes to hoops, and I love it. Hoops is one product I love ripping because there is so much random stuff and some chases. Very tough chases. But there's cool stuff to pull. And there's so many packs. Let's keep going. And there's the Joker, Jokic. And I believe he has autographs in this stuff. Mari Bailey. I don't know why. I didn't know he was a Hornet. Hmm. Interesting. Cool. He was a big name coming up or popular name. And backwards card. Brandon Miller. Okay. Hollow Anti-Gravity. All right. He's had some uh, good games as well. And some bad, but they're young guys. I like that. Well, B. Miller. Let's see if Lamella can get some help because he is. He's special. There he is, my man, Wade Wunningham. There we go. Yeah, that video was late. It was late, but better late than never. And Chris Murray. There will be retail for this stuff as well. Ooh, sheesh. Dariq Whitehead. Nice. He has some cards with Panini. Kind of like rated prospect cards. Can't believe I'm actually calling it rated prospect, but that's the name. So, there we go. I like that set. Let's see what else we can get. There's Lamello. And there's Podrick. 
And... Okay. A Sar Thompson. There we go. I know how to say his name. I'm probably going to butcher it now. Pajemski. Pajemski. Pajemski? I think that's how you say it. Yeah. I can say Brandon. Pajemski, I think it is. Yeah, I tried. A for trying. High voltage Luca. This used to be a more popular one and kind of fell off the face of the earth, but... I remember the, um... The yellow ones from a few years ago. I think were pretty popular. And then they just stopped being popular. Base, base, base. Need to speed up a little bit, but we have so many cards. Hundreds of cards. Walsh. Hypnotized. Hollow again. Cool. Now, this is expensive hoops. 1B craze is big time. And with no other NBA sets on the horizon, at least as of now, they could add more stuff to the calendar, but no 23-24 sets are dropping for a little bit as of now. Origins is the only one I see on the horizon. And that's, I think, January. And that could be pushed back like every other set. So we could be Team Hoops for a long time here. Finally, the last packs. So it's Hoops or Bust. Hmm. Purple. Is that 1B? Got everyone but 1B and Scoot. Grant and Wallace. Hmm. Not looking good for us. That's why we have two boxes, but... Come on, 1B. Don't play. Look at that. Mac. Got his, uh... that dunk contest picture, I think? It is. Because I don't know what other NBA shot they'd have. And everyone has their phone out, so I'm assuming it is. Okay. Man. Untouchable. And... Uh, Strother. If I butcher any names, I'm learning. Slowly. Or a little faster than that, but... Collecting and watching. Eventually I'll learn them all. And this is the beginning of the season, so... There we go. And Ignition. This is new LeBron. Sweet. Last two packs from box one. No Wemby so far. Auto was alright. Yeah. Kind of it. No Redback so far, but I have a feeling. I got a feeling. If you have nothing in the pack, Redback. Rhyme me intentionally. There we go. And there we are. And one last pack from box one. So far, it's been, um, you know, it's been hoops. So, haha, <laughs> last pack mojo, baby. Well, uh, Jet Howard, Ignition, and Wembenyama. Tribute. This guy, I'm praying he stays healthy because so much talent, man. So fun to watch. There we are. Nice. Ooh, ooh, ooh. My initial prediction was, I think, 15, 7, and 2 blocks. Probably to boost that a little bit to like, I don't know, 17, 10, and 2.5 and blocks, but he's a baller. So much potential. Time for box 2. Box 1 was solid. We got Wemby finally. That's his tribute one. That's not his base one, though. We want the base more because that's his kind of true first NBA card. And here's the... um. The stacks, which I just combined. I probably shouldn't have. But we'll put that there. Get our packs out. Here's box number two. The only con with hoops, if you don't like a lot of base and a lot of packs, is there's a lot of base and there's a lot of packs. So, that is a con for some people. I understand that. And, um, regardless, Wemby. That is my counter to that. Wemby. So, here we go. We still have some 23, 20... Actually, no, 22-23. This is 23-24. 22-23 sets. We're so off with the years. It is confusing. The remainder of products, that's not this one coming out, are 22-23. Even though we're in 23-24. Because Panini is very behind. But the remaining sets until Origins should be 22-23. There you go. And that is Paolo, Chet. Chet or Wemby. Who's Rookie of the Year? Marcus Smart. Go Grizz. And uh, Jordan Poole. I don't know, man. Looking grim. Jet Howard. And Potatum. Let's take a look. There's a... Hmm. So I'm wondering why that Giannis wasn't numbered. That should be a 2024, right? Or 2023? 2024, I think. I am confused. 
Either error or they stopped numbering them, which is wrong. I don't know why. They would stop that. If you need to print more than 2024, then it's time to look in the mirror. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, Wemby. Hello. Oh, ho, oh, so nice to come twice. You know what? Why not? Why not? Hello, Wemby. Dale Ellis. Okay, not Wemby. Wow. That's a nice pack. Autograph and two Wembys. Oh, and it's 25. So this pack, I can safely say I made my money back on. Just this one. The others, probably not. But two Wembys. Okay. And if you want the Wemby chase, opening packs, so we pull a numbered Wemby or a rare insert. Rare -er. Um, Let me know. Comment down below. And I'll try it. It'll be crazy. It'll be a grind. We could get lucky. Could be a first pack. Most likely, I think it's be a long one. But I want to see a big one Yama card. His first NBA cards. I'm sick of waiting. It's time. Okay. Now, what are your thoughts about Wemby only having the Bowman autos? And thoughts on A, the autographs. B, do you like or not like the license thing? It does limit the amount of autographs. It's not, say, 10 trillion Wemby autos and you know 90 sticker sets every product galore. It puts a uh, very low supply, very high demand on those few autographs he has, which is just um, Bowman U, Chrome, Inception, and Best. Maybe more. They might add some more. And Ginter. That's right. So, do you like the scarcity? Because, oh! They have been printing this stuff like crazy. This is new. Here we go. Curry in a hurry. Presentations. Not one per box, but if I had to guess, one every two to three boxes, I think. One of the rarer inserts. I'm out of sleeves. At least cut sleeves, that is. So, and I'll actually show you guys right now. Someone was asking. These cards, the corner can catch on the sleeves and get damaged. So I cut it like that, just like that. And now the card will slide in with no risk to the corner. See? And there you go. Little uh, tutorial. Back to hoops. Do you like those? I do. I like them a lot. Kind of like the manga comic stuff we've seen in recent sets and not recent. Reminds me of manga mixed with the year one kabooms or the first like few years of kaboom. So I do like that set. I wish it was like a case hit because there is no kind of case hit in this stuff. That's guaranteed. Here's guys been playing well. Hawkins. So, um, yeah. There's several rare cards. And those cards being the Hoops Art Signatures. On card, top rooks, some with curry. And Presentations is rarer, but not the rarest. And then there's Rookie Special and the Playoff Sets. The rare ones of that are pretty good. So, that's kind of it. And uh, what do you guys think? Should there be a special guaranteed case hit or no you like it just how it is and and Monty Bates he was that guy Tyson Daniels to 199 okay I've actually pulled a black one of one from hoops before last year's hoops I pulled the J-Dub one of one black in our hoops chase actually I think right yeah right I think it was so that's why I want to do a hoop chase again. It was the one of one black J Dub, one of the best rookies in the class. And crazy. So should we do it again? I think we have to, right? Now, I mean, obviously we always want to trend up. Does that mean it's time for the Wemby one of one? Is Hoop saying open me, please? I think so. So we'll uh, get a ton of packs and just rip that stuff until we pull something really nice. Hopefully Wemby. Please. And that's it. And there's Scoot. My man. Nice, nice, nice. I like Scoot a lot. Oh, sheesh. There we go. Now we're cooking. Oh, baby. All right. Scoot Henderson sheesh. I'm out of sleeves. I'll sleeve it after. Just to save time because there's so many packs. There's hundreds of cards in this video. So, that I like. I like that set. I like to put it together. And maybe, what, three per box? Maybe? 
One to three, I'll say. I think we probably could if we did a hoops chase. I don't know how many people are in the set, actually. Maybe, say it's 50 max. I don't think it's 50, but like, say it is. You know, hoops chase, I think we can do it. I don't know. I mean, there he is again. Is it time for the one of one? Do I control the pop? Let's see. No, it's the 99. Ah. So it's him. His one of one. He was a rookie last year. I pulled his one of one. It was crazy. It's hoops. Okay. Last, uh, like, 90 packs. There's a lot of packs. And apologies if it's very loud in terms of background noise. Weather today is not very great. Every time we record, bad weather. There's a nice rookie there. Scoot again. The more the merrier. So, it's rainy, it's windy, and, um... I can hear it. I don't know if you guys can hear it. You might hear it every now and then. And there's our little background noise. KP. And Chet. Honestly, I think Wemby's going to win it, but Chet. Thunder. They are up to something. There we are. Kobe Brown. There's a couple Kobe's in this class, I think. Next pack. It doesn't look like we made a dent in this stuff. But we're going. We are... Trying our best to uh, keep a good pace. See the cards. And, uh... Is he a buck now? Was he the one traded? Or is this post-trade? There we are. Or he's on some team. I don't know. Maybe it's Blazers. I think he was part of that trade. Honestly, I forgot. Sorry, man. I will learn at some point. So many, uh... Things go on in the NBA that... Don't remember everything. And there is a Jalen Slauson. Okay. And Anthony Black. And then uh, Giannis. Cool. Next pack. I feel like this is the hoop chase itself. Seriously. Now for the hoop chase, I'll go way faster. Not going to review the set. Interesting. What is that? And we just fly through it. And see a bunch of big hits. And then Thompson. And if you want to see our breaks once again, we'll open some of this and we can see a nice sample size. Show me hollow, I guess. Right? Yeah. There you go. Anti-gravity. Jet Howard. The Magic. Not just the Magic. So many teams have way too many good players. I feel bad. Because so many stars, or would-be stars, aren't getting touches, playing time, opportunities. And... There's so much talent, so it's time for expansion teams, in my opinion. We need it. There's too much talent in the league. So many guys are buried in the depth charts. Star Thompson and Hendricks, anti-gravity. So, I personally think we need a lot of expansion teams, like, in the next 10 years, 10 to 15 years, like, six teams. What do you guys think? Yes, no, and if so, if the answer is yes, how many teams and where? I think Seattle... Vegas. Outside of that, I don't know. Um, yeah, those are the two. I want the Nets back. I'm a Jersey guy. I want my Nets back. I want them back now. I want my picks back. Like draft day. So, Brooklyn can change their name to something original. And the New Jersey Nets uh, return. There you go. Three teams right there. And then maybe... Hmm. I don't know. Where else? Comment down below. But, I mean, there is so much talent. And it's a shame some of these guys are not getting opportunities. I mean, look at the Thunder. They're going to have to lose one of those guys, too. They can't keep all four under the new CBA. I don't believe so. So, one of Giddy, J-Dub, Chet, Shea, and that's just what they have now. They have so many assets, they could have a fifth guy. It'll be tough. And... Sheesh again. Jalen Hood, Shafino. I mean, I'm going to try for the set. I'm going for it. I hope so. I got four already. Out of two boxes. The hoop chase is going to be over a case, probably. So, we will see. And... Backwards card again. There's Giannis. It is... Donovan Mitchell. High voltage. Okay. Nice. All right, last four. Okay. Why do I feel like we've seen 
zero number cards. No, those are the green J dub. That is the only one I remember. So maybe one more number card. I could just be forgetful. I am forgetful. So there's a good chance that we pulled like eight number cards. I'm sleeping, but I only remember the green J dub. Yeah. All right. Last uh, three here. Three or four. Can we pull something nice? So no monster so far. We did see Wemby's first NBA card, which is nice. That was the goal of this video for me. Just review the set and pull Wemby. And if you want to pull a big Wemby, there's Grady we got next. How about we got now? Grady. If we want to see a big Wemby, just say down below, we want the chase. Or say chase. Or just like the video. Simple as that. And subscribe. And that will uh, let me know that we want more. Not just a taste. There's Derek Lively, another good rook. Is it red back? Is it color match red back? Yes, it is. Duncan Robinson. Sheesh. All right. Last pack. It's been a ride. Hundreds of cards. Look at that base stack. Oh, my goodness. And uh, 30 minutes of hoops. I couldn't imagine a better way to spend 30 minutes than with some hoops, right? Mm -mm -mm. The first NBA set for the season. And uh, for the next couple months, the only set. And there we go. I'm going to try it again. Uh, Pajemski. Pajemski? I don't know. You guys let me know. And there we go. That concludes this year's hoops. Which box won? One or two? Comment down below. And uh, once again, we have breaks for this product featuring National Treasures as well and this giveaway. All the information down below. Sign up on WhatNot using that link. We have a giveaway stream on Saturday at the time of recording. And then uh, actually tomorrow and Friday at the time of recording, we have uh, breaks featuring hoops and NT for the ultimate chase. And um, yeah, shouldn't be crazy expensive. I'll try to keep it as cheap as possible. So here's box two, the highlights. Got some uh, good stuff. A lot of more kind of bulk. Sheesh. I'm here for it. I like it. Hollow Jet Howard. It's not a bad card. Um, hmm. There's Scoot. Yeah, now we're talking. And... Okay, there you go. I was sleeping. Oh, I was sleeping. Yeah, so to 199 Curry Presentations. That I like. Wemby 1. Dale Ellis to 25. That's numbered. And Wemby 2. And Tatum to 999. So I was sleeping. Simple as that. There's box 2. And here's box 1. Let's see. Wemby. Got a little ignition. Got a little bit of Brandon Miller. Purple. Asar. Not numbered. Oh, Sasser. And to 25. I wish I could swap those two, but... Uh, Non-numbered Giannis. I guess this one's not numbered anymore. Or it's an error. Um, yeah, I don't know. And then uh, Gary Trent Jr. Can't forget that one. And there's uh, James Harden. And that concludes Hoops. Our review of the new NBA Hoops. Box 1 or Box 2. I'm going with um, Box 2. Love this Curry. Awesome cards. I love the Sheesh. Scoot Henderson. So I need a 1B now of that too. And there we are. Overall... I definitely think the price is high, but um, there's high demand for Wemby stuff, and this is the only NBA set, so yeah, 200 kind of low, mid $200 range. I'll give a rating of, and this isn't something that I love to say, but I'll say like a 4.75, a little bit below average, just because the top three rookies aren't in here. I still hate that there's only one autograph for the price, there should be two. Most sets around this price have two, I feel like, and um, or some other you know way to provide value, whether it's a mem or something, so I wish there was also kind of easier chase card. A lot of these chase cards are almost unobtainable. Think about the hoops art. They might not even be one per case. They weren't in the past. And same thing with uh, the rare finals cards. Those are just crazy rare. So um, just some more kind of stable value because the floor can be low with these. But Wemby is going to be um, big time. And these are the only cards. So number Wemby, that's pretty much it outside of the uh, Bowman U autograph. So there we go. What are your thoughts on the new hoops? Personally, happy to see it. Got some cool stuff. No monsters, but a lot of nice cards. And those are for our view, guys. Thank you guys always for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Until next time, I'll see you later.